Hi everyone! This is the right video for those of you who are searching for DIY cheap art supplies. I will teach you how to make these spray inks and also some very interesting stamps. All you'll need to make the first project is acrylic paint of your choice, a spray bottle with warm water because it blends better and beads. So once you filled your spray bottle with warm water, you want to add enough acrylic paint to cover the entire bottom of the bottle, like so. Then you just need to add a bead, this is just for the water and the acrylic paint to blend better. Then you shake it and, yep, this is it. These are other colors I've created, as you can see the pinks, purples, blues, so on and so forth, you'll see all of them. And the greatest thing about this project is that just by adding a little more acrylic paint of any color, you can change the colors you had previously made if you are not 100% happy about them and create new shades. For example, I was not that happy with this shade of pink, so I ended up adding more purple. For the second project, all you'll need is foam pads. I bought these ones that you can see here. You'll also need a blow dryer or a heater, depending on what you have, and then whatever you want to use, charms, stones. So I started by cutting a piece of foam, the size I wanted, and connecting these toothpicks. And then you just apply the heat on the side you want to use, and when it's hot enough, you just need to press it hard against whatever you are using to create your stamp. Mine looked like this and I was really pleased with the result, but it is time to try it. So stamping and here we go. And this is another one I made with stones. As you can see, it kind of looks like a wall of stone, which I really love. This was made with chains, this with flower charms, which I love, this one with coins. Another one with a charm, in this case it was a music note, a cat pendant, clockwork, roses and a wire spiral. One of the best things about this project in particular is that when you're sick of that shape or when you've used in as many projects as you wanted to, you can pretty much hit it again and just create new stamps. This is it, two simple ideas and yet you can save a lot of money and still create beautiful art. So please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like this video and see you guys next week. Bye!